I think their first run out of there if I'm not it's, it's a big day for them, they most of probably got a little bit carried away, it's a fantastic day. I mean, we got a little bit lucky at the start, but we've worked pretty hard this off-season. We knew it was going to be a big occasion and what we saw was the fact that we were, we were ready to play. We knew it was going to be a test because when they played inside the first thing grand final and recruited international players, that was always going to be a tough, tough ask. Yeah, of course, yeah. especially only living five minutes away from uh, the stadium, five minute walk. I get a lot of pressure on me from ones that are coming in the pub and telling me that you know, you're going to get a beating and stuff. Like I said, it's only not been together that long. You know, Reese has been recovering from injury to the off season. That became in a little bit late. So, yeah, there's plenty of potential there for them to, to work together. And what we saw was you know, two quality players. I think that's what we looked at when we recruited both of them. It wasn't the place that they were, you know, people told us that they were, it was what they could be. And that's, we saw some glimpses tonight. We did, yeah, we ended up with um, a back row on the wing, a back row in the centres, a um, half back and full back. We lost. Uh, both of us, two centres, full back, our second full back. <laughs> Forwards were all right, but all our backs into just fall to pieces when we were not going to it, it was stood up again. I think we're going to stop battle hardened yet. And uh, Paddy had already said in a few minutes, like, the first 20 minutes of the game was for some of them, it was like, well, just because of the pace that we're expecting the Super League to be, the pace that we want to go, we want to go toe to toe, be the best side in the competition. Last year, and, it showed the lads, but if you don't go there, then you don't actually understand that you can stay there. And what we learned today was that yeah, it's, it's very, very, it's very tough to live with some of the best sides in Super League. And then we've got to get used to that. Yeah, of course. Um, I, I mentioned to Dennis before I came in here, uh, I've never been so tired in the game. First 10 minutes of the game, I was. Uh, I, was, uh, I, was, I was very, very tired. And, uh, <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to say anything to you. Uh, but this is not BBC, mate. You can say that. <laughs> yeah, oh, I was blowing, blowing up my backside. So, so. I, th I think it's the same with every rugby team. Everyone has that little bit of banter, which makes makes everyone settle in. You know, a little bit of icebreakers. You know, calling people names, if you will. <coughs> Something as simple as that might. Uh, might make a team gel, and uh, we've been doing a lot of uh, team building as well. You know, going to Coniston was, was a good one. Uh, carrying logs up a mountain, things like that. So you know, when you need to rely on your teammates, they're there for you, and uh, that's been really helpful. This is uh, this is my fifth season now in the first team, so um, I've been here as club for a long time. Uh, they've always looked after me, and I hope to look after them. Uh, our real test will come when we've been together 12 months or that kind of time, and then we'll know exactly where we stand. If you rush these things, you end up breaking really easily. If you don't, then you can end up with some sort of can last you for quite a number of years. I think that's where we're at the moment as well. You can see there's, there's plenty of banter, there's plenty of enjoyment because rugby players are rugby players no matter where you're going to But we've got a real good mix. The lads that came home from last year working really hard and now it's a good opportunity for them. The lads that come in from other clubs know that this is a club that's got places. It's got plenty of support, and it's got plenty of people that want to make them better. But they're behind into it as well. So it's, it's, it's a progress and we feel it's not to keep repeating that just because we've played a couple of games in Super League we've played since Ellington and getting close to that time. Cameron comes in and gives us lots of mutuality value as well, which is cool. Which is pretty good after what happened today. <laughs> so we, we, that's what we need. We needed somebody that could cover those outside back positions and full back room centre. What is played at a really high level. Our, our goal is ultimately to to get to that stage where we compete on a level market with transfers and people coming out of contracts in the English game. And nights like tonight can show people that we actually are moving forward and want to be a competitive beast.